You know, when I ask people what their favorite exercises are, the exercises that they love to do all the time, glute ham raise is never on any of those lists. But whenever there's not an exercise on somebody's list, that probably tells me if you want to be a warrior, it's something you should be doing all the time. So the glute ham raise is something I'm going to show off in a second. It's one of the more challenging exercises and an exercise that you might not be as familiar with because not every gym has it. If you've got the Training for Warriors book, you'll see that there's a partner way to perform it. So I recommend that if you don't have one of these exercise pieces of equipment in your gym. Right now with the glute ham raise, what I'm gonna show off is I'm gonna show it off as a body weight version, I'm gonna show it off with a weighted version with a 25 pound plate, and then I'm also gonna show it off with a band version, which is accommodating resistance where it actually gets harder and harder the further you go. The glute ham raise is an incredible tool for calf strength, hamstring strength, glute strength, low back strength. So the entire posterior chain, it's, it's puts force through it like no other exercise I've ever performed. So, to get into the glute ham raise, you actually put your feet inside the hooks. The pressure is going to be across the knees and the thighs, which is pretty tough. But you can see that the calf is working and the calf crosses the knee joint to actually create flexion at the knee as well. So in this position, I'm going to start here. From this position, I'm going to use the calves and hamstrings to pull up. I'm going to come back down. Use the calves and hamstrings to pull up. Come back down. Use the calves and hamstrings again. Now I'm going to reach down. I'm going to grab a 25 pound plate. And now perform it the same exact way, which makes it way more difficult. Just adding this force because now you can see that the lever is so long when I come down here, it really challenges my hamstrings to really work harder when I do this. And then the final version, the one that might be the toughest is accommodating resistance, where now what I'm going to do is I'm going to place this band around my neck, and then as I come up, the force is going to get stronger the whole way. So I come into position, band around the neck, Come all the way up, come back down, bend all the way up, come back down, and one more for nine, bend all the way up, hold, take it off, and down. So, the glute ham raise, incredibly, incredibly difficult exercise. And again, there are a lot of variations and ways to use it. I recommend you try this stuff out, but that you start slow, because the last thing we want is anybody tearing their hammies off the boat. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, if you want to find an exercise that's demanding, and incredibly tough for you, this one is it. And if you can make it one of your favorites on your list, you're gonna be a warrior sooner than you think.